Welcome everyone to HFN, also known as Houston News. Today is the first day of February 2021. We're going to give you all an update on AMD and give you all a heads up as to where we're expecting the price to go so we all can get in position and capitalize on the price movement. Now, before I go into that, if this is your first time watching this particular video, you guys appreciate getting a heads up as to where we expect price to go. Make sure before you go, hit the like button, share the video. Also, you want to tap that bell notification as well so you do not miss out on our price prediction that we are producing here for the stock market. So let's dive right on in. Let's take a look at the market in AMD. You all can already tell that we placed a forecast on AMD. Now, that forecast was created on our other channel, Houston News, where we used to do cryptocurrencies and stocks all together. We went ahead and separated it created this second channel only for stocks so that video is still in the playlist though on our channel at Heathen News but we did that video on the 8th of January right so let me zoom in I'm sorry no 5th of January and we expected a market in AMD to make all-time highs right we said that on that video that the market literally in AMD is going to try to make all-time highs and the trap was successful at it he actually made all time highs into the market for AMD. Now, 5.7% profitability into the market. And it took what? Five days for that to play out. But nevertheless, that's like a percentage of profit every day within the trading range of us predicting that on, the, on January the 4th. Congratulations. This is the only way that you're able to capitalize onto the market. You got to get the leg up against the trap and get in the position. So when he finally takes the price there to where you expect it to go, you'll already be there with your bag open. So congratulations, 5.7% there. Obviously, we need to talk because the market in AMD over the last couple of trading days has been going lower in price. Okay. Now, one thing, earnings has already been released. So that is not going to be a reactionary thing that the market will endure in a sense of where price is going to go. So let's look at the market real quick in AMD on a three day time frame. You all can see here that the market in AMD is generating a little bit more weakness here. So one of our main focuses on this video will be where will the trap come in and prop up the market? We need to make that determination. You can already see that we had $88 as support. We close on that on the last completed three day price bar. That is cause for concern for those who are looking for the market AMD to go higher in price. It is. So, where would be the next area then? $84, $80, $76. Where will be the area of support? What about on the five day time frame then? The five day time frame in AMD definitely hints that $88 is not going to be maintained as support. It's just not. So the next area will have to be 84 and then I'm eyeing around $80. Let's look at this on the weekly. See, even here on the weekly time frame, the market in AMD is weak. So yeah, we're going to expect the market in AMD to give us some weakness. We're going to expect the trap to meet us at lower prices. We already said $84 to 80 and then 76. Now, based off the spread of the last couple of weekly price bars, I'm not expecting that support to really come in around $84. I'm really eyeing 80 to 76. Well, how do we end the month then? Even on the monthly time frame in AMD, we can definitely see the market come down to 80 to $75, which is not all is lost. I mean, the market is still really trading in areas that we have already seen in trade. So even though we're anticipating some weakness to come through into the market AMD, we're not saying that we're looking for a 20%, 30% drop in price. 
we're simply saying that the market is going to go lower. Now, you might see something totally different, which is fine. But based off what we're noticing on these variant time frames and the price bars, there is definitely some weakness to iron out here in a market in AMD. So let's go ahead and do it real quick. Okay. Now, we said that this area is going to be restriction initially, 88 but I'm going to tag it up there around $92 as restriction. Okay. Simply meaning I'm not going to expect the market to go higher AMD until we see this price literally close up above $92. And it will have to be on strength. We cannot see the market come up here on weakness. And we said that $84 is an area that the market is going to try to come in hold support. I mean, that's a 2% movement in AMD, but we're going to try to TP the market right there around 80. Okay, so that's about six and a half percent movement to the downside in AMD. Ultimately, 76. Okay, so we're going to TP the market in AMD around $80, which was about what? Let me see again. Six and a half percent, all the way back down towards 76. And that's it. We're in play. This is our expectations. We're going to keep this line here just a little while longer. I want to see if the trap is going to come back in and try to test it. Meaning, is he going to try to bring it back up and break it above that restriction area of $88? All right. So now, questions, comments, let us know. Uh, make sure you maintain a profitability. Now go and trade different.